beats us to the punch. I'm here with Big Ben Rafu. As you can see, he's uh, really excited to be here. What do you, what do you do here tonight, Ben? F*** you, Mick Terrell. <laughs> and Mark Hunt. And <laughs> Lorenzo Hunt. You're all f And I will f***ing smash every one of you. All right. Piece Jeez. of shit, Arnold Adams. Anybody else you'd like to call out? Todd oh, Duffy. Oh. Todd Duffy deserves the fight because he's cool. Copeland, you're a f***ing warrior. It's all about Big Ben Rothwell. Ben, did you know I have on my Big Ben Rothwell shoes tonight just for you? I didn't know until just moments ago, but now I am honored, and that's why I'm freaking the f*** out right now. I was actually pretty calm. I was, I was talking very sensibly. I was being nice. And then she's like, Ben, look at my shoes. I'm like, oh, mother I'm going to everybody. I'm going to fight right now. So seriously, we were all wondering what happened to you at the last fight. You got the flu? <sighs> Tuesday before the fight, I got my, it started with my son. He got sick. I called my management. I'm like, I'm worried. Things aren't going right. By Tuesday night, it was clear I wasn't going to do well. Doctors wrote up, you know, I went to the doctors on Wednesday. They're like, there's no, there's no, there's no way he's going to fight. So... Dave, Dave Feldman was like, I don't want it. We're going to have him fight. And I only proceeded to get worse. So it really sucked, man. People were like, oh, Ben, blah, blah, blah. Listen, I lost a lot of money not fighting. Trust me, I wanted to fight. Todd Duffy. Todd Duffy. <laughs> so I want to know that. You were disappointed you couldn't fight Duffy last time. What's next on your agenda? I got through all of that. I've actually had a pretty hard December in January, unfortunately, I dealt with an injury on top of the sickness. Here I am, I'm coming to the event, BKFC 57, because I'm feeling money again. I'm back in my training camp. My 2024 didn't start whenever January 1st was. No, my, my January 1st started kind of today. So in, fa in fact, I said, I think I said Monday it starts because I'm gonna go into a training camp because the boss man said, Hey, I got a fight booked for you. You're going to be ready, and I'm going to be ready. You got to tell us. It's bare knuckle news. Who is it? Come on, give us a little hint. The boss man, David Feldman, is going to be the one to tell you all who I'm going to fight and when. So we're going to let him drop it. I'm going to get ready, and when that time comes, I'm going to be there, and I'm going to put on a <laughs> show. <laughs> beep, 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 beep. Oh, Ben, you're so enjoyable. I love talking to you. Now listen, I've been checking out your Instagram. You look like a pretty good cook. You're grilling a lot. I haven't posted on Instagram in six weeks. Because I've been a little bit out of it. Mentally and physically, I don't want to post when I'm not in the well. But I posted today because I'm feeling pretty good. And I'm ready to fight again. And I am a good cook. I've been cooking for since I was born. I was, I was cooking corned beef hash at three years old. And you're like, think that's a joke? Ask my parents. What, yeah, are, what are you making parents, for me? I'll make you barbecue. a straw. I'll barbecue. Make, huh? Barbecue. You're good at the barbecue. Barbecue? Yeah, barbecue. My friend Brian Gurman's good at barbecue. I ain't even touching that. I'll cook you a filet mignon with a nice spinach salad, a twice baked potato, and a nice <laughs> chocolate cake. And you'll get your <laughs> socks blown off because I <laughs> cook. All right, I don't think we can say any more bleep bleeps for now. Is there anything else you want to add before you go? I don't got much to add, but David Feldman is a genius and an amazing man. BKFC is incredible. I can't express how awesome it is to be a part of this organization. I'm so excited to come out and put out the best. I only got a little bit of time left, and it's going to be with this organization. I'm in here. I'm going into a training camp to give my very best when that next fight comes. And to Mick Terrell, f you. Mark Hunt, f you. Arnold Adams, f you. Any of you heavyweights, f you. Because, you know, I will f smash every one of you. There's no doubt. That's right. Everybody be afraid because Big Ben Rothwell is coming for you. I'm Susan Sigari for Bare Knuckle News, and you are... Ben Rothwell. <laughs> Nobody beats us to the punch. Nobody beats us to the motherfucking punch. <laughs>